This video is going to show you how to make a movie trailer within iMovie. iMovie is the little star with the video camera in the middle. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on that. And when I get here, um, I'm in the projects view, and you can see that because projects is highlighted in the white there. I can come over to video, and this is where all of my video clips that I would actually have on my iPad would be there. And then my theater is things that I've created, finished movies, on one of my other devices, and this particular one was done um, on my iMac. So that's the beauty of iCloud. So I'm going to go back to projects, and you can see that I'm working on one there called my movie. But I'm going to hit the plus sign. And when I hit the plus sign, two options come up right away. I have movie, which is basically putting a bunch of video and images um, and your own music in there. Or you have trailer, which is kind of more of a professional type look. And we're going to look at the trailer today. So I'm going to click on that there. And when I have the trailer, I am come up with a bunch of different um, examples that there's a link to Tony Vincent's um, storyboards that he has been able to download all of the um, storyboards to help students create um, professional looking trailers. So let me point some things out in some of the trailers. Um, if I go to family, you can see that this um, video is going to be one minute, 19 seconds in total length, and that there's going to be anywhere from two to six um, cast members involved. If I go to Indie, I have two cast members and I have 58 seconds. I can preview the music or the background music and the transitions that go with it by simply hitting the play button here in the middle. And this is the opening for that particular video. And you can see the little squiggly transitions that go there. If this is one that you would like to create, you're going to go up into the top right hand corner, you're going to hit create. Now, you have here, um, your preview window is on the left, and you have your outline on the right. And you can go ahead and you can click on any of this here, so this is going to give you your movie name, and you can change that. You can hit the clear button, um, and I'll call this a love story. So this is here, and you can go through and you can name your cast members. You can click the, the arrows down and you can change that. Maybe you have a male and a male. Um, or a male and a female. Um, you can name your films. Um, oftentimes classes will name it whatever their their room number is or whatever group number, group name they are. And then they have all the credits there. So that credits always comes in the end. Um, right next to outline, once you have all that filled out, you have your storyboard. And this is where Tony Vincent's um, storyboards come in. And you can go ahead and you can see all of my text now that I put in there. Um, high definition film, a girl, a boy, best friends. You can see all the text that was over here in the outline, a boy or girl, um, is there for you. And that's going to be in that transition view of it. Um, each of the video clips, starting with all the way up top with the girl, it says 1.2 seconds and it says a girl. Um, so you can click on that there. And if I had video on my iPad, which I do not have any video on my iPad, um, I can click all and I have no videos. I don't even think I have, I do have some photos, but not a whole lot. Um, so I can go ahead and I can click on this here, and maybe I want to add this picture. And you can see that that was added now, and that's going to be 1.2 seconds. Automatically it goes down into my boy now. This is a really bad um, example. And then we have two people here, and we can go ahead and we can click on that. Okay, so that those pictures, first one's going to be 1.2 seconds long, next one's going to be 1.6, next one's going to be 2. .6 two seconds total. And I can keep going through and I can add everything in there that I want to add in there. When I want to preview it, I'm going to hit the play button right here. Okay. So you know that, notice that that's where I was down in my, that little blue box is around my video. I need to come all the way up top here um, to hit preview. And now I can preview it from the beginning. And it's going to highlight as I go through the, the actual video. Okay. Still image. Greatest place on earth. Okay. And I like what I'm seeing so far. So I go through and I go and I watch it and I add things to it. If I don't want to add something in there, um, I can just leave it blank. And then when I'm all finished with my video and I'm s satisfied with it, I can hit done. And this option here now gives me my edit. So if I need to rename it or I need to do something with it here, um, it's going to put me back into this mode, so just know that. Um, but now I have that action up button, and this is where I can go ahead and I can share it. 
Um, so I can go ahead and I can share this here. And notice again, you have um, the 